like according to the game she's pretty but according to me she's not okay water plant It's me, Lappy, and welcome back to my channel for another episode of Let's Play These Sims for the Not So Berry Challenge. Okay, so today we are going to be going off to work with Theo. Gonna clear off the bulletin board, though. However, I think I might age Maeve up pretty soon for the sake of clearing up a bit of the household and because you know she's only a day away when a stool bully step in and stand up for your friend I guess poor Mabel gets so little love because she's the youngest kid but yeah the girls have to go off to school in a minute I think I can't decide if I want to start working on Mariah's aspiration or age her sister up, but I gave her some new outfits, changed her hair. I wasn't too happy with how she, with how she looked before, but I think she's pretty cute now, so I like it. But I think I might have her go out and start working on her aspiration. I just kind of want to get her out of the house pretty soon. I don't know. Just a lot of thinking going on. I also changed Maeve's hair color to be more of a darker color pink than it was earlier because there's a whole pink generation anyway but I'm gonna have the girls all study hard today and I'm gonna have to go with Theo to work pretty soon she's getting close to the top of her career she's at level 7 right now so it shouldn't be too long before she's up at the top in theory anyway uh, her next promotion will be Pioneer of New Technologies. She has already got her skills mastered. She completed her aspiration she needed to complete. And I'm just kind of working on the super parent aspiration for the sake of having something to do. Because why not? Hmm, who's walking around out here though? Some really sad a really sad Caliente girl with her hair sticking through her head. Oh, that's unfortunate. I guess she must be Nina's kid. There's Don Lothario. I wonder if Don's had any kids. He has four kids. Okay. List them. Darius Lee, Silas Caliente, of two Caliente kids, one of which is named Messiah, and that's gotta be the most um full of oneself name I've ever seen a kid given. I'm just saying. Just saying. Okay, work for Theo starts in about an hour. Uh, kinda wanna... Just gonna sell this real quick. I'm gonna have Eliza get dressed, too. Just cause I don't want her to be walking around in her pajamas all day. I know she's a stay-at-home mom, but come on. Oh, Eliza's gonna be aging up really soon, too. She's gonna be old. I made ha age her up prematurely just so I can... Yeah, I'm probably gonna age these two up prematurely. Probably once I've finished... Gen 1. Or... No, I'm... I might age Eliza prematurely, but I'm going Mariah in front of everyone. Sure, why not? Okay, and now she has an excellence bunny in her inventory. That's good. But, like I was saying, before I was so rudely interrupted by the game, I'm probably going to age Eliza up. 
She's gonna. I'm gonna age Eliza up when Mariah gets pregnant. Cause what I wanted to happen was I wanted for her to have an unplanned teen pregnancy. So I'm gonna need to clear out room in the household, which is why we're gonna be aging Mabel up. Okay, yeah, not Mabel, which is why we're gonna be aging Maeve. And I think I'm probably gonna end up aging Mabel up prematurely too, when just a couple days early. Because I'm getting close to the end of this generation and I don't want to have to deal with extra children any longer than I need to. But, um, Theo is supposed to be good friends with the Gen 3 kid. So, I'm not going to age her up prematurely or anything like that. But stuff needs to happen. And it needs to happen soon. Okay. Okay. Just gotta wait for it to load. For some reason, the science lab takes a while. So yeah, my plan for today is to get Maeve out of the house, uh, work towards a promotion, I guess next episode's goals will be similar? Question mark? But yeah, I, since there's really nothing else to do but just wait for her to get her promotions in this generation, I don't know. Upgrade the Simray with Mind Control Eat, okay. I don't want to invent a whole new Simray, especially because I don't have any metals or crystals on me right now, so I'm just going to pop that down, upgrade, finish upgrading the change up upgrading it to change outfit. Oh, we need to pay our bills. Okay. Okay, we will do that then. Just gonna walk in and work on our career stuff before anything else. Can't believe we keep getting uncommon stuff. Like, I think uncommon stuff should work just right too. I don't want to join Renegades things anyway. That does seem like something that's right up our alley, but it's not something I'm interested in doing. We need to mind control people to sit, however everybody is already sitting. What if I just get rid of these computers so they stop messing with them? Just gonna take these away. Okay, just upgrade the sim ray, then come over here. Um, oh yeah, it's not in her inventory anymore. Okay, we'll do it though. That is high up on our priorities list. Okay, just... Okay. Mind control is sim to clean. Mind control s three to sit down. Okay. Uh, okay. Mind control to sit. Do that first. Find somebody else who's sit standing up. Also, gonna mind control you to sit. And one more. Nobody's ever down there. Okay. Uh, let me look back here. Okay, Yuki's over here, so I'm gonna just reset her real quick. So she stands up, and we will mind control her to sit as well. I love that evil laugh, though. I love her so much. She is truly a mad scientist. A mad, mad, mad scientist. And I love her. But yeah, one of the issues... 
I'm kind of stressed about the first and third generations being so interconnected. Because, like... Oh, man. Because I don't want to be wishing for Theo to die, but her granddaughter's not allowed to have any friends till she does. Who's Yuki having a kid with? I need to know these. I need to know these things. Oh, Gavin Richards. Okay, that's not too bad. Okay, she's gonna go sit down now. And we will mind control Elsa again to clean. Okay. Browse web on computer. I just got rid of all the computers. Okay. I'll buy one again. It's okay. It's just annoying how people, how the Sims will autonom 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 autonomously go onto the computers and make it impossible for you to talk to them or use them. Okay. I mean, somehow it feels like browsing the web at work isn't something she should be doing, but if I need to do it to get her work performance up, I will do it. Experiment on the chemistry lab for an hour, okay, we can do that. She can push the big red button now. I'm curious to see what that does, honestly. But not curious enough. Uh, what could we get with her aspiration points? She has steel bladder. Hmm. Hmm. I don't know. I'll wait a little bit. Okay. Will that count it if I cancel it? No, okay. Okay, whatever. Okay, let's go ahead and pay our bills, though. We'll do that, which will bankrupt us, and then browse the web. Just gonna speed things up a tiny bit. Okay. But yeah, I don't want Mabel to be a child for too terribly long. Because, like, she was an accident, and I don't want to have to wait for her before I can really work on the second generation. Okay, just pay your bills, and then browse the web. Mind control co-workers to change outfits. I can just do one co-worker three times. That's something I can do. I wish we could, like, get rid of a certain amount of work things a day. Okay, Mariah has a B. Mabel's done with school. For, everyone's done with school, so let's have her go ahead and build up her charisma skill, I guess. I hate this command so much. Okay, we're done. We done it. We done did it. Okay, we need to mind control co-workers to change their outfits. I'm not gonna bother Yuki because when to do things, but I can bother Nina Caliente because we hate her. We hate her a lot. Seeing the Caliente, I might play with the Calientes in The Sims 2, just for the sake of doing it. Because seeing them like that is so weird. When I know them so well in The Sims 4. You're not gonna There we go. She's so proud of herself. I'm not gonna bother my poor baby Yuki. Okay, mind control, change outfit every day. And then we will mind control her again. To wear her swimwear all over the place. I don't know. I don't care. Nina's not very good looking. 
Like, according to the game, she's pretty. But according to me, she's not. Okay. Water plant. Okay, this plant is dead. We can't help it. We can water this plant, though. Alright. Almost good. Just wear your bikini all over the place. We don't like you. And... We have our full performance for the day. Yay! I'm gonna go out here and try and dig up some common metals and crystals because we're gonna need those eventually. Dig. Dig. Come on. Dig. Because we need these for inventing. And it's good to have a stock of them just sitting around. Especially when you're a scientist. Okay. And eventually we're gonna get to get the invention machine at home too, which is really cool. I can't wait for that. Imagine how much stuff we can make. Ooh, she dug up a capsule. I don't care. I don't like these. A punium. Is this common? Okay. I can hang this down in our lab downstairs. All right, and another capsule. Whoop de frickin do! I hate these. I'm sick of digging them up. But I mean, we were just completely bankrupted by our bills, so I guess it's a good thing that we're digging up capsules that we sell for seventy simoleons. <sighs> We still have Dennis Kim in our inventory. We still have our cloning machine in our inventory. I kind of want to make a clone of somebody. Just for the sake of having like a servant or something around. I'll keep him in the office. He loved his job so much he died. He was worked to death. Okay. And dig up here and here. Oh, we found a rose. Do we have one of those in our daughter's room? I can't remember. Okay, she's gonna need to eat soon, though. More punium. Another capsule. Okay, she did a fantastic job today. Sweet. We are fresh. Oh my goodness. I'm so sorry. My foot hit the wire and my entire microphone decided to fall off my desk. Um. And my cat is struggling to catch a fly. My goodness, this is chaotic. Yeah, Tiger, you get that fly. Okay, he walked away because he saw somebody pull into the driveway next door. Yeah, go Tiger, go. Oh, no, nope. he's still going for the fly. Giving you a detailed play-by-play -play of my cat hunting a bug in my bedroom. I kind of hope he kills it, because I'm getting sick of it buzzing around me at night. Granted, it only lives for a certain amount of time. But it's very annoying for the time it is here. Okay. I mean, if the game could load, that'd be great. I, d I don't wish for much in life. I just really want my game to hurry up and load so I can actually play it. Like, is that too much to ask for? Is it- is it really so much- okay. Okay, we're here. What a day of work. Theodosia is back home, and she has earned 1,662 simoleons. Alright. The game 
needs to be paused. I'll just give it a second. What do we have in our inventory? Oh my gosh, we have moodless solvers. Okay, Eliza, darling. Would you mind making up a nice strawberry cake for our darling daughter, Maeve? I'm gonna move her out of the house and mark her as unplayed so she can have kids of her own and have a life and a family. Okay. Ooh, and I'm thinking about aging up Mabel too. Because, like I said earlier, I don't want to have to worry about keeping up with her. Maybe when she's a teenager, we can just leave this house to her. I don't know. Because teenagers are capable of living on their own in The Sims. I mean, probably in real life, too, because I know somebody who's been providing for himself since he was, like, 15. But, like... Especially in The Sims, they can legally live on their own. Provided people die and leave the house to them. But okay, let's go ahead and add some birthday candles. Hang on, I want to put this cloning machine downstairs. So I don't forget about it. There it is. There she is. Beautiful. And I'm going to go ahead and put the satellite dish out as well. <sighs> I mean, that works, right? Oh, whatever. I'll straighten it out later. And Maeve, why don't you go ahead and blow out the birthday candles? One of our children is a young adult now, and I'm so proud. <laughs> but okay. And she's grown up so fast. Okay, and I guess she can be unflirty. The exact opposite of her sister. There we go, and I believe she aged up with the responsible trait. Yes, she did. Okay, cool. Alright, and I just want to check and see how close Theo is to- oh god, she's nowhere near a promotion. But okay, I'm gonna go ahead and end this episode here. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, please feel free to leave a like and comment and subscribe. And I post new videos every single day, so if you'll check in tomorrow, I'll catch you on the flip side. Bye bye